the changes need to happen at the state level, that um, some of the uh, amendments to the charter will need to happen at the state level. And what I'm committing to is our election may be done in August during the primary, because right now there's mm -hmm. three Republicans running. There's no That is an interesting point. No Democrat yeah. running. And what I would like to do is use the time between when I would take mm -hmm. office in November mm -hmm. and our, the end of our election, which is in August, to then lobby any congressional, uh, state congressional uh, folks and get their commitment that they would sponsor a bill that I would write for them that would exactly mirror the eight is enough uh, legislation mm -hmm. and have that passed at the state level as well. Okay. Let's pause just a second because there may be some listeners out there who are going saying, wait a minute, I didn't quite follow that. Okay. <laughs> the point that he's making is, is that at this point in his race or right now the, for the seat now occupied by Commissioner Eggers mm -hmm. and for which there are two other, yourself and a third uh, candidate, uh, Correct. Uh, who's a Republican, uh, Heather uh, Bernie. Uh, Bernie yeah. uh, there is no Democrat in that race at this point in time. Now, may there be tomorrow? There could be. But at this point in time, there isn't, which would mean, if I understand it correctly, and I, bl I believe I do, and I uh, think you've just reinforced that, that the August primary between the three of you, if that's all that there are, would be the election itself. The winner of that primary would be the new member of the county commission. That is correct. So let's, but, but that would happen only if there is no Democratic opposition. Correct. And that could happen yet. I mean, it's it's yeah. uh, we've got to three months, I think, before uh, qualifying that. Qualifying is in, is okay. in May, yes. So, so setting that and, and making that clear, let's go on again. So you would propose legislation, if you were an elected official at that time, to the state legislature to take up in the subsequent uh, legislative cycle, which would be 2023. Correct. And that legislation would say to amend the Pinellas County Charter to mandate uh, two years. Correct. Part two terms. I believe the, the Eight is Enough group is currently talking about uh, a two-year term limit. Two-term. 